Good morning. When we think of fall, we think of pumpkin spice, football, and falling leaves. But for 23 million Americans, the change of season also means fall allergies. Ragweed pollen is one of the major culprits of this frustrating, with frustrating symptoms like itchy eyes. Dr. Tessa Sokol joins us now with information about seasonal allergies and helpful advice. Welcome. Thank you. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Doctor, when we think of allergies, we typically think of spring, but fall allergies are just as common. Why is that? Fall allergies are terrible. Ragweed is the primary culprit, and with its very, very lightweight pollen, if you have it combined with the dry, windy air that we get in the fall, it is just blown all over the place, and millions of people are suffering from it. Sure, and what are some of the common fall allergens that can trigger eye allergy symptoms? Ragweed is the most prevalent, but we can't forget that there are grasses and then when the trees fall, the leaves fall, that there can be molds that form on it. There's indoor allergens too, like pet dander. Sure, and let's talk about these symptoms. How can we differentiate between allergies in the beginning of a cold or the flu? It is extremely difficult to determine whether your symptoms are related to allergies or whether it's the cold or the flu. When you have allergies, we have a dry, sore throat, congestion in our sinuses, itchy eyes. Those are the symptoms that you can also get with colds and flus. So it's extremely important that you go to your doctor to tell the difference between whether this is truly allergies or if you are suffering from something severe like the flu. Sure, and do you have any tips on how people can be proactive in managing their allergy symptoms? For your eyes specifically, we get very, very itchy eyes. One way to proactively take care of that is to go to the pharmacy, pick up a non-prescription eye drop called extra strength pad a day. One drop in each eye gives you relief within minutes for a full 24 hours of those itchy eyes. Okay, great, and where can viewers go to learn more? If you go to your local retailer, most of them carry pad a day. You can just pick it up yourself without a prescription, or if you want more information, you can read about it at pataday.com. Wonderful. Thank you so much for your time today, Dr. Sokol. One more time, you can visit pataday.com to learn more. For Connecticut's Morning Buzz, I'm Jillian Andrews.